bad. You're bad. Yeah, you're bad. Carla was swept off her feet by this dashing young gentleman. Carla <laughs> loved telling everyone about her relationship with Paul. She described it like something out of a movie or a fairy tale. But I think he had that little bout of arrogance. Something wasn't right. 14-year-old Leslie Mahaffey told a friend she was heading home, but she never arrived. Kristen French, a high school athlete and a straight-A student, was abducted from the front lawn of this church. There was a palpable sense of fear. The rapist has terrorized women all in the same general area. Everything can be done is being done. And we'll get you back. Kristen was found not far from the edge of the roadway. The entire city was in horror some of the most heinous crimes ever in the country. Carl Hamalka goes to the police. It's clear she was abused. If I didn't say the right thing, he'd hit me. He held knives to my throat. He told me I better watch my back. Carla tells the police that her husband is actually the murderer of both Leslie Mahaffey and Kristen French. She explains to the police that Paul was stalking young women at night driving around looking for potential victims. He would rip hair out and collect that as souvenirs. His ultimate fantasy was to have, like, sex lives. I wanted to rot in jail because dying is too good for him. The assaults had actually been videotaped, which was an extraordinary revelation. He reached in. I'm standing here looking in amazement at, at what's in my hands. I was in shock. What I saw was six tapes. There was just no way to foresee what was on those tapes. Tapes that completely shattered the illusion that showed she was no victim. This was a lethal couple. I saw Carla's participation and it was absolutely shocking. It was undeniable that she participated in sexual activities with Kristen French and Leslie Mahaffey. She was not forced at all. She was a co-conspirator. Dubbed the Ken and Barbie killers because of their extreme good looks. You're the one with the brains. You're the one that's manipulative. Leslie is still not coming home. In what has become Canada's trial of the century. She played the police. Had she gotten away with murder? Bye, Papa.